for allowing me to talk. Thank you. Since beginning, I never look towards government to produce music. I have over 80 albums in the past 20 years. Nobody in West Africa can boast of 80 albums with at least 12 songs per album. You multiply 80 times 12, that's the catalog of Kenny's music. That was done on sweat. Now somebody is lifting us up, lifting me up. I feel lifted. Lifting me up, say, oh, you've tried. Come on, let's go. That means Nigerian music that has been accepted globally is about to be accepted. I don't even know. <laughs> That's why I'm so excited. Because you see, Nigerian music, we've displaced dance hall in the billboard. Billboard used to have a chart. They've taken away dance hall. They put Afro beats there because they see the numbers. They see YouTube, Spotify, Apples, they know the numbers. And our population, what is population of Jamaica? Less than six million. What is population of Lagos State? 24 million. The city of Lagos can outshine any Jamaican. Yes, and that is why Billboard displays the dance hall and they put Afro pits there. It's just the beginning. We need to identify good things happening to Nigeria. Every time you see people throwing stones, doing all kind of stuff, I don't believe in that. Every country in the world has problem. Every country in the world has inflation problem. Every country in the world has high prices of food, price of petroleum, price of this high, high, high. We are going through depression. But if you have a sector that is going up, we should support, and governor supporting that, making it all open to everybody to hear, deserves an applause. I, I don't, I'm getting emotional. I don't, want to, too, I don't want to talk too much, but I just appreciate what you've done, sir. I, 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 you are a lion. Please celebrate him. You are a lion. You are a lion. And, and of course, all everybody here, I thank you so much.